Hi guys, here's a flip through of the Explode the Code one and a half. Um, I have done flip throughs of pretty much all the Explode the Codes that I have. So please like and subscribe to Hand in Hand Homeschool. We won't comment too much on this particular one. Um, we'll just do a flip through. These flip throughs really help me to um, decide. So the one and a half goes hand in hand with the one. So basically one activity from Explode the Code 1 um, will then um, say the next day, so I'm planning on using the next day, I go to the one and a half. It basically just reinforces what they've learned in the first book. So the one and a half reinforces what they've learned in the one book. So we will go lesson one and Explode the Code 1 and then lesson one the next day and Explode the Code one and a half. So it's reinforcing what they've learnt. Please pause, this is going too fast. I've saved so much money over the years by looking at flip throughs and then deciding that it wasn't going to be a good fit for my son or daughter. This particular curriculum is interesting to me because I have some resistant writers. So being able to circle or just join them um, will work for mine. And spell by just circling will work for mine. This is the review lesson. Now I have said in my other videos that these were hard to find in Australia. I end up getting them through christianbooks.com and it ended up being about $14 or $15 a book. Um, that includes the shipping. Um, I think you can get them on Amazon but it did work out more expensive. But if you're going to try out just one or two I guess paying a little bit more for the one book might be better than spending a lot of money for the whole set. Getting it shipped out together. So a lot of the same type of activities, so the kids get comfortable um, with the process. The same type of activities, predictability. Now, if you think something might not work for you, for example, this won't work for my son. He just went right bed. So I'll ask him, how do we spell bed? And we'll either get stickers or stamps or I'll write it for him.
And if there's any pages that you think your child, well, this is a protest, um, won't work for you, just skip that bit. Digitation, reading, post-test. Okay, well, that's the quick flip through of one and a half. Hope this was helpful. I have flip throughs of the rest of the Explode the Codes. So like and subscribe to Hand in Hand Home School. Thanks, guys.